here's another episode of Godly Play. Christ is risen. Christ is risen indeed. Hello children and adults and welcome to Godly Play. I'm so happy that you are here, that we're able to worship from my home to your home on this joyous Easter Sunday. If you're watching this in the morning, we have our Easter Fellowship at 11.30 a.m. this morning. And if you've been doing the fish banks um, during the season of Lent, make sure to bring those by uh, as you come to Easter Fellowship. Children, I am so happy that you are here. Uh, and I'm so excited to share this story this morning. As we enter this space this morning to hear the story of Easter, to hear the story of Jesus who shows up to his disciples, let us begin with a simple prayer. Repeat after me, friends. Gracious God, open our hearts and ears to the good news of Jesus and the love you have for us. In Jesus' name, Amen. As we prepare to hear our story today, We enter into our story that comes from the Gospel of John and the Gospel of Luke. Jesus died, but God made him alive again. And some of Jesus' friends saw the angel, and others ran to see the empty tomb. And Jesus called one of them by name. She knew the sound of his voice, and she saw him. And many of Jesus' friends wonder what really happened. Two of Jesus' friends walked and talked with a stranger on the road to Emmaus. They did not know who the stranger was until he took bread and blessed it and offered it to them. And then they knew it was Jesus. Jesus was alive. And Jesus' friends hurried back to Jerusalem to tell the others. If you're counting along, we're getting close to 10. Here we have the disciples. So then that night, as Jesus' friends hurried back to Jerusalem to tell, that, uh, to tell others, 
That night, ten of Jesus' friends and other followers met together, and the doors were tightly shut. Suddenly, Jesus appeared before them, and he said to them, Peace be with you. Peace be with you. Some of the people were frightened when they saw this stranger. Some even thought he was a ghost. But Jesus, Jesus said, why are you afraid? I am alive, just as I promised. See the wounds in my hands and feet? Here, touch me. A ghost doesn't have flesh and bones. Have you anything to eat? They brought him broiled fish and honey, and the stranger ate. Now the friends of Jesus and the other followers knew this really was Jesus. Jesus was alive. I wonder how the disciples felt when a stranger appeared. I wonder how Jesus got into the room without going through the door. I wonder how they felt when they saw the wounds in Jesus' hands and feet. I wonder if they said anything to Jesus. Hmm. I wonder what you wonder as we hear the story on this Easter Sunday. It was at the breaking of bread, of Jesus arriving to his disciples and saying, Peace be with you, that we hear the good news of a risen Jesus, a risen Christ, that even when wounds are still in his hands and his feet, Jesus says, Peace be with you. My love is with you. I am with you. Friends, as we close our time, let us close in prayer. Will you pray with me? Dear God, we thank you for this day, for this Easter Sunday of Jesus risen, that Jesus is with us, that Jesus loves us. Lord, we thank you that Jesus came back and shared the peace with his disciples and shares the peace with us. Lord, let us share this peace with one another. We ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. 
Thank you, friends, for being here with me. I hope I see you at Easter Fellowship. If not, I'll see you next time. Bye.